Hello everyone, Joel from RC Max UK here. I've got the MCD back out, the MCD XR5. Bit of short grass here, uh, it's kind of flat. Doing a little bit of prep for bash fest. So just to say, more holes in the body. Holes, holes, holes. The whole front is cut out. The wheel wells are enlarged for these bigger Astro Max sized wheels and tires. Again, holes here at the side, at the back. Now, all this is to do with airflow. Now, if you know anything about these big bore cars, these big bore engines, you know they're air cooled and they need air. They need good airflow. They get very hot. Things like the um, Losi 5T, it's got a cage. The panels are quite open, really. The whole back's open. The MCD here, this was totally enclosed. So lots of cutouts and there's good reason for them to keep it cool. So a few more cutouts and just another run here to see if I can get it running nice because I have a feeling this could be absolutely mad once it's set up properly. It's pretty mad as it is, but I think it could be really an absolute beast. Let's give it a go.
Right, bit of a roll over obviously. Let's take a look and see what's uh, what's going on. I doubt anything's going on to be honest, but I'll have a quick look. Oh, <laughs> my
I'm gonna call it a day there with the, the MCDs. I'm running out of light, I'm running out of time. But um, yeah, this surface today is a bit grippier. The grass is a little bit longer than the last place and it's not wet. And if anything, it's too much grip. So I might have to do something about cutting the edge off these tires or something to get them a bit less edge grip. So a couple of rolls there. This, just to say, is a stock MCD XR5. It's the one of the good additions, so it's not the cheap addition. It's got the, the nice alloy braces, although it's got the plastic up the front. So I think it's a, the kind of, not the top spec one, but the kind of middle spec version. And drivetrain wise, for me, it's, it's doing very well because we all know, and, and, and again, something else you know if you run a big bore, that the low C drivetrain you have to beef up uh, you will break pins and things like that, drive pins at least, if not drive shafts. The Baja stuff you need to go, ALX dog bones and all that if you're running big bore. For reliability, obviously you can run the standard stuff but it's going to break. So for an MCD like this to be totally stock and taking a 46cc engine like this with this kind of power uh, and not to be breaking anything, oh I've broken the bumpers or this bumper I've melted in fact or have I broken it <laughs> I don't know I've broken it somehow okay so I've broken <laughs> I've broken that bumper there I'm not sure how but um anyway okay so oh and this side as well So what have I done? I melted the bumpers. Okay, <laughs> I don't know. I think the tires might have melted the bumpers. Is that possible? I'm not sure. Okay. Oops. Um, okay, so anyway, <laughs> moving on from that. So yeah, anyway, as I was saying, um, for it to hold up like this is pretty impressive as far as MCD is concerned. So I'm, I'm impressed with that. But anyway, I'll leave it there. I uh, hope you enjoyed the video, guys. And uh, thanks for subscribing. It's appreciated. All the comments, great. I love it. And yeah, just let me know what you think about it. I'll see you in the comments. Take it easy, guys. Catch you next time. Right, just to show you now, I've got the body off. These bumpers, I think what's happened is on the roll, it's actually got caught in the tire, in the wheel, and it's the inside of the wheel here that actually melted through the, the bumper and burnt it off. So it's got caught actually inside the wheel. Let me take wheel off so I'll show you. So there's the, the melted bumper, and there's the, the tire or the wheel, and you can actually see, see if I can get some of it off. Oh, I got bits of it off a minute ago. There's a bit. So there, you can actually see. Hello. Hello, you all right? Not bad, how are you? Yeah, all right. Susan? Yes, she is, yeah, yeah. You can see melted bits of bumper. Thank you.